good FACO is done and I am trying to implant a single piece IOR but a tip of cartridge made PCR. It is better to push a little bit vitreous which is projecting in AC and first is confirm that the wound is without vitreous. Better to enlarge the bone and try to swipe away and see the extent of vitreous in AC. Once it is swiped in a center, injection or a pot is injected to push the vitreous in a posterior chamber and try to plug it. Once we are sure that enough injection or a cot is injected and chamber is deep, we can inject a eye oil in the bag. Now to implant the eye oil in the bag is attempted. You see carefully a bubble moving towards the tip of the cartridge showing that a biscuit is trying to come anteriorly. It is better to push it again back with the help of a metacellulus from the side port. Implant the leading haptic in the bag very carefully and gently. Unfold as slow as possible. Once it is confirmed that leading haptic is in the bag, Inject extra methylcellulose over the optic of the eye wall to make the chamber deep. Once it is confirmed that it is enough deep, then we can try to push the optic in the back. Here we should not do the dialing of the hour. Here we will attempt to flex the loop rather than dialing. So optic in the bag is confirmed and then after injecting additional methylcellulose a trailing haptic which is in the anterior chamber is pushed back you can see here the first attempt was not successful so I deepened the anterior chamber again there should not be any leakage of methacellulase when you are trying to flex the trailing haptic. Once it is enough, enough deep, we can flex the loop and put it in the back. Oh, let me confirm that whole IOL is in the back. and see the opti is also in the back. This is a confirmation of any vitreous in AC by swiping the iris repositor. Once it is confirmed there is no vitreous in AC If there is a vitreous in AC is found, it is better to stain it with the 
tricot or trimethylone and do the vitreous term a good hydro is done to prevent the leakage and injection microcode is injected to make the pill as small as possible it can be attempted from the multiple port so that different areas of iris is contacted and if required additional hydro is done at the main wound you can see the pupil is getting smaller and smaller and there is no notch of in the round pupil suggesting that there is no vitreous in entry chamber low border height irrigation is done and avoid aspiration otherwise you may aspirate vitreous so only irrigation is done no aspiration after this injection moxifloxacin is injected intracamerally thanks for your attention